Welcome to the Coach's Vault. I'm Brian Brazil, and today we're going to go over Smith shooting. So Smith shooting is a simple shooting drill. Uh, what I like about it is you get a ton of touches and a ton of reps in a short period of time. You can probably go through a bucket of balls in about five minutes, and the lines are really limited. Um, the setup for this drill is very simple. Just box up four lines. Um, you know, depending on what type of shot you want to see, it'll depend on how wide the lines are apart from each other. Generally, when we set this up for runners, I'll have the kids almost outside the box um, so that when they're catching the pass on the shallow underneath cuts, they've got enough room to generate a nice outside shot on the run. Um, for step downs, you can have them a little tighter. And if you want them working on their inside shooting, even tighter than that. But um, balls on the left-hand side of the cage, and it's going to start with the ball in this line. And player one is going to pass across. This player will receive it and pass down. As soon as that down pass is delivered, this guy's going to cut, receive the pass inside, and this guy's going to cut right off his back and receive a pass. Now, again, based on what you want to generate for shots here, runners, jumpers, inside shots, or step downs, predetermined at the beginning of the drill, or let the kids do whatever they want and um, make sure they're repping that way. Once the player generates a shot, he continues to the line that he received the pass from, and the feeders go right uphill. And then again, just over, down, cut, cut, shot, shot. Um, again, heavy reps. Uh, you can see a variety of different types of shots, and you can also do it from X coming uphill uh, so that attackmen can see shots where they're wrapping the cage. For that, we're going to keep the setup identical, uh, but we're going to start with over, up. Now we're going to cut here, receive this pass. And the balls, again, are here and here. And as soon as he does, you know, more of this angle, catch, shoot. This player is cutting, catch, shoot, follow the line that fed you. Feeders move downhill. That's it. We'll go out on the field and wrap it live. Okay, so we're out on the field, and we're going to go over Smith shooting. We've got four lines here, uh, four cones, rather, designating four lines. And we've put all the balls on this half of the field. This drill is going to start with a pass across from Travis Campbell, and then we're going to pass down. When the ball gets to Husey, Travis is going to cut through the middle with his left hand, catch this, and shoot. Right off his back is coming Campbell, who's going to catch this ball from Sean, and shoot. Shooters are going to rotate downfield, so they go to the line that fed to them, so they're going to go downfield in the next. Feeders are going to go right uphill. And it's just a constant drill. You should be able to go through 50 balls or whatever you have in your bucket in like two and a half minutes. We're going to start with just step downs. So I want everybody coming off the pick, catching, planting your feet, step downs. Then we're going to progress into runners or jumpers from there. And then at the very end, we'll catch, walk all the way in, or run all the way in, throw a fake on the goalie, and finish. Sound good? All right, here we go. Down. Cut, cut. Good. Over. Passing over from here. Down. Cut, cut. A shot. Over. Down. Cut. Cut. Good. Here we go. Now we're going. Save the runners. We're going to go to runners in a second. Actually, let's go now. Runners. Everybody's on the run. Over. Down. Cut. Cut. Keep our feet moving. Good. So, fellas, we're all runners now. Again, over, down, cut, cut. Let's delay this cut, G, until we've gone down from Rasta. Um, who's that, to Travis? When Travis gets the ball or the ball's in the air, then you start your cut so you don't get too shallow. We can get a good runner. Here we go. 
Cut, cut. Go ahead, Rasta. Good. Nice job. All right, that was Smith shooting. Thank you for watching the Coach's Vault.